surprise and uh, strong opposition to this bill. It literally uh, terminates air quality, land, water, and conservation funding that will impact all communities in our country, particularly in my state of California. Page by page, the bill takes aim on the water we drink, the air we breathe, and the environment we live in. Now, as a person of faith, I believe there is a moral and an ethical uh, responsibility to protect the natural resources provided by our Creator. This bill undermines the Clean Air Act's ability to crack down on air pollution, damaging um, the Act's ability to protect the public health. This will threaten the quality of life for our children, our families, and our communities. Far too many of our communities still suffer from poor air quality. Too many families and children, particularly in those of lower income and in most vulnerable communities in our country, they face the impacts of toxic air pollution each and every day. And far too many of our children, our seniors, people with asthma, cardiovascular and lung disease, diabetes, they live under added threats to their health from breathing polluted air and the impacts of global warming. The dangerous uh, budget cuts and the anti-environmental rioters uh, will just lead to more polluted air and less protected water. This bill also uh, includes significant cuts to our national parks. By crushing the land and water conservation fund, this bill would eliminate funding for important park and conservation projects throughout California and across the country. The bill also cuts funding to green economy work, which creates jobs, paralyzing EPA's ability to work with businesses to identify and implement cost-effective and more efficient strategies that advance environmental protection, job creation, and economic progress. Species extension will also be accelerated by this bill. I just don't um, understand why any one of us would want to kill off endangered animals that scientists are telling us need protection. So I, I'm really at a loss um, for words this morning, Mr. Chairman. I want to thank uh, our ranking member, uh, Mr. Moran, for his work on this bill. Um, I look forward to working with all of you and all of my colleagues to reverse these losses and to protect the gains that we've made so far as this bill moves forward. But again, we have to remember this should be really a, a moral and an ethical issue that we are dealing with under this bill because truly we are the preservers uh, of this planet and we have a duty and responsibility to, to do what is right. Thank you again. If there's no further general discussion,